Tiger World is an educational center that allows visitors to watch endangered species in their natural setting. Leah Yannikas is the driving force behind Tiger World. She is an executive with the company in Rock Hill and serves as owner, tiger handler, and trainer of Tiger World. The whole reason I think Tiger World exists is from the initial relationship that I created with Zeus. He opened my eyes, created this whole world for me. So Tiger World would not exist if it wasn't for Zeus. Leah's motivation to rescue animals started as young as three years old. After watching a Save the Tiger special, she receives calls from all over the world to rescue animals. I think my favorite part is uh, the relationships that we build with these animals and to enriching their lives in captivity. And of course, uh, there's nothing like um, taking an animal out of a bad condition, turning their life around, you know, here at Tiger World. The cats eat 450 pounds of food daily, which was a considerable expense until recently. We actually are getting probably 3,000 pounds of meat per week in donations from the community directly supporting all these big cats. While rescuing cats isn't a daily job for Leah, the need is always there. You know, they just have a thought in their mind, oh, the cubs, they're just so amazing, I want a baby tiger. Uh, but they don't have the education, the know-how, or the experience to know how to care for these big cats. And of course, he's adorable at this age, and anyone can pretty much handle him at this age. But within six months, he's almost 100 pounds. He's already chewing through your furniture, tackling your children. Just doesn't make a good pet. Most of the other animals Tiger World receives are in need of care. This particular lion was uh, being fed dog food, which is not appropriate diet. He had bone disorders, uh, malnutrition. Once an animal has been rescued, Tiger World begins the process of rehabilitation. But Leah does not do that alone. So we, we have amazing staff with great education, great experience with the animals. Then we have probably about 10 volunteers on a regular basis that come all the time. Several years ago, Leah wrote a million dollar check to buy this facility. Tiger World has challenges. It's about $12,000 a month to operate the zoo, in addition to food donations. One of the things that I uh, designed Tiger World around was my financial limitations through my other career. So I've designed Tiger World to be able to be sustained through my incomes. Leah's focus has grown beyond her original idea. My mission initially was tigers. It's called Tiger World. But when, there, when we were contacted with all these other animals that needed rescuing, birds, reptiles, monkeys, we expanded and opened our hearts to all these other animals too. Leah is optimistic about the future of Tiger World. Uh, but I'm hoping to be able to grow Tiger World through um, more visitors, more school groups, and donations to have Tiger World self-sustaining. This is Lanana Major reporting for Carolina Connection.